Can you turn the laser back on, please? No. Go towards the green light if you can. So people, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Spooky Season. You've probably seen my last video where we went to a spooky maze. If you haven't seen it, I'll put it up here. We didn't find our way out, we lost the game, but it was fun nevertheless. So yeah, check that out if you haven't. I come here two years ago with Jamie. It is just, just us two. me and Jamie. And we're also staying in the old part for two nights this time. If you're enjoying the spooky season, Make sure you subscribe on Road to 5K and smash the like button for the ghosty, spooky videos if you're enjoying them. Because we will do more. We are planning to go other places. So let us know if you recommend anywhere that we should go in the UK. We may get it on for you. Um, requested room four. And as you can see, I'm not, I'm not that tall of a guy and I'm already touching the ceiling. So this room's a lot smaller. Honestly. A lot smaller than before. Even in the size of it, it's only just about enough for the bed to fit. You've got the old style four postal bed. And you've also got here a wardrobe, which actually does make... Dodgy noises. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it does make a creaky noise, so that will be interesting later. There's still light outside. So, um, just a quick bit of information about this inn, if you're interested. I will put a link below so you can go and check out a lot more because I don't want to waffle. It's basically a smuggler's inn where smugglers, they don't like to call themselves that. They like to be called that. They don't like to be called smugglers or pirates. They don't like to be called because this hotel is situated on a, a moor where it's just basically hills and countryside. So you're, you're isolated. You're just in the middle of wind and fog. And it's where they used to take their horses to change them and also, they used to do a lot of trade in here. So a lot of stuff went on here and a lot of smugglers used to visit here. Just whatever they could get. And also, also a lot of murders happened here. So, over the years, because this has been here since 1911, I believe. I may be wrong, but like I said, I'll put it all in the description for you. So, there's a few ghosts that have been spotted here. I think there's a two or three children. One's a boy, uh, one's a little girl, which we stayed in next door which is room five. She actually has toys that people leave her in the wardrobe. So yeah, we saw that room, but this time I wanted to see room four because it's the most known for activity, apparently. We'll soon find out. It's gonna be interesting, so stay tuned. We will be doing an investigation later, once it's dark. It's now 7 p.m., we're gonna go for some food. It's starting to get a bit darker. Yeah, we'll go for some food and then I'll get back to you. dinner we've just come out to get some fresh air jamie needed to get some leads Cablings. just some cables from the car look at the moon that's probably what you're going to see in the intro if, if i did insert it but yeah the moon's trying to come through the clouds it looks proper spooky adds to the vibe like i say i've been here two years ago so i do know what it's like but people have heard apparently horses they've heard horses and carts coming through the cobbles we're just about to go back to the room for a bit now yeah, Jamie's gone up early because he wanted to go to the toilet, so I said I'd meet him up here. Getting all our equipment out. Um, we've got a lot more this time than we've usually used. 
So I believe all, all we had last time was the K2 meter, a few cat balls. I believe, I I believe that was it. I know we used them at Red Lion. Yeah. We went to Red Lion. But yeah, as you can see, we've got a lot more stuff this time. Um, but yeah, let me run through what I've got. We've got your K2 meter, which I'll show you how it works in a minute. It's, a, it's, it's just a electromagnetic field reader. So if you go near electronics, it does go off. Just to show you, look, let me go near the light. As you can see, it's starting to go off a bit. Doesn't really work with that, but it works with your phone. See that it's starting to go off now. As you can see, it's picking up the magnetic field of the light. But what we do is we keep it away from our phones and cameras and devices, which may set it off. Um, so yeah, I'm going to check the room with that soon. See if we get any spikes or any zones that I feel that are stronger than others. Also, this time I have purchased. It was only cheap. Apparently, it's very effective. So I've got a laser grid. I will turn the lights off soon. But like that, we're going to set this up somewhere. So if any spirit walks through it or wants to manipulate it or bend the lights or make the lights flash on it, apparently they can do that. So we have that as well. Also, we have cat balls, which I'm pretty sure you saw it in my last videos. They are a touch sensitive um, device which are made for cats but they're very very effective with spirits apparently they can touch them or move them make them flash things like that so that you see it's off if anything was to touch it a little bit it will flash so bear in mind the floor is uneven in here and we know that so if it does roll due to that we won't say it's anything but we've also got the dowsing rods which are used for water, I believe. Finding water mains and things in the ground. But these are, can be a very effective. If we ask it questions, we can ask them to cross, ask them to open. They was kind of working for us in the red line. So it will go like that, for, like, for example, it will open or close. When we hold it really lightly in our hands. Also, we've got, this is new. I've only just bought this. It's a REM pod bed, so it's a kind of like a boo buddy junior but it's not called that because um it, it's not the american one but this is very very sensitive this bear so as you can see all four um hands or feet are lighting up let me just put it over here for now for example if you turn the light out a minute so as you can see all four are lighting up as you can see now they've stopped so now turn the light on a minute just so i can show them so as you can see now, it stopped flashing, but it, it makes a kind of like an, a magnetic field. So look, if I was to go near the field, boom, see? They're flashing, now they're not. They're flashing, now they're not. So we've also got the S-Box, which for me is very, very effective. In the red lion, we caught, we caught, yeah. we believe it's the old monk that was telling us to leave. He said, just go through this but it scans frequency waves and they can apparently say a few words through this device. So yeah, we're gonna charge up everything. Most of it's charged, but yeah, we're just gonna prepare, sort of set up things in the room, make sure they're working, and then we're gonna get into it, so. I'm charging up my phone ready for TikTok. We just heard a tapping noise in the toilet. I think it's a tap, but. It sounded like running water, so. Yeah, like. Like dripping. Find out. Cause yeah, that that's uh, a bit dodgy. There's no one even in it. It's just me and Joby. Oh, right. As you see, there's no water down there. There's no water in the sink. Right, it's just a standard standard bathroom, right? Dripping. No, it won't. There's no water marks in there. Yeah, that's bone dry. Ain't even, ain't even the sink neither. Bone dry. Something like that. That was strange. But we'll leave a cap for you now. If it does go off, you will see. And this floor, let me just show you. 
is the solid ground, so. No movement at all. Turn the, well. Yeah, look, so solid ground, look. Even if I'm stepping near it, nothing. So, you just saw I walked out of there and hasn't gone up. Just give it one last motion just to make sure it is working. She's on. So I'm just about to set up the TikTok live. Um, by the time you're seeing this, it's probably way too late. But follow my TikTok for future videos and future lives. If, if I go to another place like this, I will go live again. Show you what we've got. Basically, we've got cat ball there in the wardrobe area. We've got a cat ball inside there. And I've also set this up. The bear doesn't seem to be working at the minute. Just constantly flashing. So I kind of need to try and sort that out. If you have any tips for me, do let me know below because it's new to me. Got that. Hopefully. So I was just sitting here. <clears throat> if that was you, can you do that again, please? I just saw that cat ball go off when I sat on the bed. Don't know if it was me that moved the floorboard, maybe. But I've just done it again, it's not gone off. Can you make one of the other one cat balls go off? We have one in the bathroom. Alright, so I've set up the laser grid. The bear's currently not working still, it's still flashing. So, ignore that for the minute, but I'm hoping it's going to sort itself out. But we're going to try the laser grid near the door and see if we get any response. Got a K2 down there as well. Yeah, that's true. Why not? So we've got the K2 there as well. So if any EMF spikes come through, we will see it. That's good. That's mate. better. Use that energy if you have to. Nice. Thank you. Can you make it go off if that really is someone? Can you turn it down, take your energy away from it? Take it away, that's it. Take it away, make it go right down for us. That's it, keep going, take it away, take your energy away. Nope, you wanna play with us. Okay, if you really want to do something for us, can you, on the chair next to that, there's a cat ball. Can you make that light up as well, please? Or any of the cat balls. I've got one behind me. Guys, so I just missed it on my... YouTube, but I'm on my live. We're asking it to go to cat balls. It's now making the grid go on and off. Bearing in mind, there's something holding the switch on. Is is this the child that's flickering this? Thank you. <laughs> Are you here to play? Yeah, if you're here to play, can you make one of the cat balls on the floor flash as well, please? We're not here to harm you or scare you at all. Is this a spirit playing with the laser? If it is, can you make another device go off? I have one in the bathroom, which is right here. Can you make that one go off? Just an update for the YouTube. Yeah, the laser we've now got on charge um, because we feel like it was playing up because of the battery. We're not 100%, but we're going to charge it and we're going to see how it goes. But we've now moved it teddy bear into there with a cat ball next to it I know it's not working properly it's still flashing <clears throat> but there's a cat ball next to it so that will confirm if anything goes towards the bear or if the bear even falls over yeah you'll know that's mad they've crossed again that's ask mad. them now to open them could you reopen them up to us please The 
nice little tough. Use my energy if you have to. It's slowly going. They've done it. Yeah. If so, <laughs> Guys, that's not that K two's not really been going off the whole time. Now it is. Is that you making it go off? If it is, cross these rods. Cross the rods. And now that and now that EMF's gone off, as you're asking it to cross the rods. No way. Look, the EMF's now off, guys. And the rods have just crossed. Are you behind him? Are you behind me? Can you point the rods in a direction where you're standing, please? Yeah, point the rods in the direction of where you're currently standing. Is there anyone here with us? What's your name? Did you used to visit here? It sounded like a yeah, but I'm not sure. Are you a smuggler? So let's say that. Is there children here? Bit of a hit and miss. Got a couple of things really. Not sure what the audio's caught because a lot of times when I'm editing, I don't. Uh, when I'm filming, I don't hear nothing. And when I'm editing, that's when I pick up these random sounds like people talking and kids playing in the background in the hallway Catch, yeah. just constant random noises with these videos so yeah so i don't know yet i'm gonna go out for some fresh air just freshen up a bit because we was live on tiktok so yeah we just want to recuperate freshen up a bit but right now i've left the cat balls i've got a gopro filming It's so nice and peaceful. It is, isn't it? So quiet out here, guys. So that's the, it. That's the Jamaica in behind us. We set up the bear by the door. It's cat ball inside, and we've got the laser on the bed. So let's see now if we can capture anything. Is there anyone in here with us? If there is, can you make one of the devices go off, please? Can you go into the bathroom? If you feel like you haven't got enough energy, use our energy. Wow. Can you turn the laser back on, please? No. That was instant. That went instantly, and the K2's going off now. Wow, thank you. Can you turn it back on, please? Turn the laser on, please. No. Oh my God. Thank you so much. If you really can, can you make the cat ball flash for me in front of me? right by my feet. 
Can you make that flash? Or can you make the teddy bear stop flashing for me? Leave the laser alone now, please, if you can. Use your energy on one of these other devices for me. Make the cat will flash below me. You can use my energy if you need to. Are you a lady? If you're a lady, can you turn the torch back on, please? I mean the laser. Turn the green laser back on, if you're a lady. Thank you. I'll take that as a yes. Do you want to communicate with us? If you do, turn the laser back on again. on the bed. If you want to communicate, turn it on please. Are you hiding behind the door of the bathroom? That said what door? That's what I thought. Did you hear that guys? It said what door I'm pretty sure. The bathroom door. Are you scared of us? No. Did you hear that no? I'm pretty sure that was a no. You've got no reason to be scared of us. We're only here to communicate with yourselves. What did I say? Do you want to talk with us? Trying. I heard trying now. Guys, if you hear any words, let us know. Is there anyone down by the bar? Someone is. Someone. Someone is. I heard go then. In the background. Go, t go towards the green light if you can. Is that what I don't you? That's what I thought I heard, yeah. Do you want me to go there? Do you like guests at your hotel? Do you like people? Do you like people's company? Do you want our company? Do you want to be friends? Don't laugh. Okay, I'm gonna go now. Guys, that's crazy. I feel like we got a fair amount there. But yeah, that was a bit crazy. I feel like she was turning the laser off, then on, when I wanted her to. She was making the K2 go off and on. 
but I got a few odd words. I've used this before and I was getting a lot of clear words like leave and just go. Couldn't seem to do the cat balls though, which was a shame. That would have been good if she could have lit up one of these cat balls, either one. But we will try again soon. So now's when it's dead of the night. So from now till about three, four o'clock is when sometimes you get most activity. So we'll find out, we'll find out. Outside lamps, as you can see, it is really dark now. It's pretty cold as well, and it's really, really silent here. But that is the Jamaica room behind me. We're gonna give the live a go one more time until 4 a.m. around 4 or 5 when it starts to get light um, because we have breakfast booked tomorrow, so we don't really want to miss that. Time is now, but it is dead silent in the hotel. 2.52. So it's, three, it's pretty much 3 a.m. now. We're not really getting anything now, like we was earlier. I'm charging up the laser grid, I want to try that in a second. Can you make one of these balls flash for me? If you touch it, it flashes. Use your energy, go near it for me. Go near one of them. Yeah, so not much went on after we just came in from outside. Tried a few different things, even tried the laser grid, as you saw. Didn't get anything this time. Very silent now, in the hotel. Yeah, so we're going to call it. Um, we'll be back tomorrow, hopefully. It's more of a relaxed one tomorrow, so you might not see as much footage. But you might get a little bit, so stay tuned, because who knows, we've still got another night here. So, yeah, I'm going to get some rest. Hopefully some rest. And I'll catch up with you tomorrow all right it's the morning after not much really happened during the night well, not that I know of anyway I didn't get one I will still film but it won't be as much today so. so this is the bar we showed you last night it's a bit busy it was all reserved here so we couldn't sit here but hopefully later we can sit here have some lunch maybe So yeah, breakfast is done. We're just gonna quickly change, have a wash, and then we may go to the museum again. See what see what we can film in there. And then we're just gonna take it easy, I think. Yeah, we're just chilling out at the moment. Have that juicy burger. Nice burger, I can't wait for their burger. Their burger's so good here. Uh, yeah, so we're just gonna chill for a bit and then I'll get back to you soon. So this is where Jamaica Inn is. It's in the middle of the Bodmin which as you can see is loads of hills that way and the same that way so as you can tell the smugglers used to get their horses 
stop off here, get some warm, warm room, rooms for the night, have a bite to eat. This hotel was like sheltering them from the wind, yeah. as you can tell. It's a proper windy area because of the hills. And on a hill not far from the Jamaica Inn. sat by the old stable bar probably just have a couple of drinks before we have our dinner it was a dark and stormy night Cheers to that current Cornwall lager. So we've just settled down for dinner now. As you can see, we're back. So, just had that dinner as you saw. That dinner was absolutely amazing. Had it two years ago. It has not changed. That burger is still a 9 out of 10 for me. It's still a banging burger. Right now, it's just me and Jamie left. Like, no one is here. There's just bar staff, they're about to clean up. Doing our research, room four being one of the main rooms with activity. That was last night, so now it might be a different thing. Yes. You never know. If it was, make that cat ball go again, please. Well, you're not going to go now because we're looking. That was mad. There you go, there you go, there you go. Bravo. Thank you, Jack. Oh, sorry. Right, get another one out now. Let's see if we can do another one. Is it, is it Jack? I thought there's someone. Because look, bro, it's not moving. Thank you. If that's someone doing that, thank you. Well, it's got to be someone. Bro, there's there's no, no way that's moving. There's no way someone's moving it. It ain't us. It's not us, because it would be moving. Bro, but Will's in bed. Look, I'm eating nuts, bro. And as you lot know, it takes a lot of force. Look, walk past it. Show them. It takes a lot look, of force. Look, exactly that. Look, force. that's how much force it takes, guys. And it's got a... That was weird. The sprit, can you make that cut ball part one more time, please? Just one more time. It's all ours. I'll leave you alone after. I'm just eating my peanuts, please. Thank you. It actually listened. God damn, you know that what? You, you know that listened to me as well. I'm intrigued. I'm actually intrigued. I need to film with Randy. Right there. Right there. Now I'm intrigued, bro. You got now I'm intrigued. That ball. You got the ball in there. 
guess you don't want to communicate. I'll go sleep them. Alright, that has been the Jamaica Inn stay. Part two. Part two, pretty much. We caught quite a lot. A lot more than last time. I haven't edited it yet, so there may be some audios that I caught. We'll soon find out. It's a shame that my bear wasn't working, as it should have been. That would have been interesting. That would have been brilliant. Would have been. Um, but yeah, we're just going to head home now, because it's getting, getting kind of late. It's half ten in the morning now, I think. Yeah, it's half ten, so we need to hit the road. Um, but it's been a brilliant stay. Always love staying at Jamaica Inn. And yeah, if you're enjoying the spooky videos like this, let us know, hit the like button, and subscribe if you haven't. We're on road to 5K. Help me hit it before Christmas. Put in the comments where we should go next. Let we'll us know where you want us out. to go. We'll try and go for you. And yeah, as always, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.